many people are sick, many other they can be infected, and the burden of the disease, it is big. People could not work, could not sleep. So if we die in sleep, we cannot, we cannot work. So what happens? It becomes poor. Onchocerciasis, or African river blindness, caused by the parasite Onchocerca volvulus, currently infects 37 million people, more than the entire population of Canada. The disease lasts your entire life, disabling you so you can't sleep and you can't work. Onchocerciasis is a disease caused by a worm. They migrate uh, in the subcutaneous skin and the adult worm forms and then we see uh, a terrible uh, itching reaction in the skin. Uh, we can also see destruction of, of parts of the eye that can lead to blindness. It's a worm called Ongoseca vulvulus and it is transmitted from an infected patient by a black fly called Simulium. Simulium are always hatching their eggs where there is a falls, yeah? running water. The itching due to uh, the skin reaction to the microfilaria is one of the worst skin uh, itching conditions that's, that's known. They don't sleep during the night, and when they wake up in the morning, you cannot do anything, you cannot wake if you didn't sleep, and you still continue scratching. You cannot be able to wake as a person who doesn't have any problem. The effect of podcasts is not directly seen like malaria, like HIV, like TB. We've got malaria, we've got AIDS, and we've got other, 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 other health problems which the district has to solve. Diseases like onchocerciasis, they kill the people slowly, and uh, it's real affecting, and it makes them more prone to malaria, AIDS, and TB. So, in the world, there are 37 million people who are infected with Onchocerca. Uh, why, why do you think that is? What's the reason that there are so many people still infected?